Well, first of all, uh, we would immediately stop uh, any new development on the Alberta tar sands, and we would close the tar sands down within five years. We'd also guarantee the jobs of those displaced workers in more sustainable industries. And we are in favor of compensating Aboriginal peoples and communities that have been poisoned by the tar sands in northern Alberta and elsewhere in the country. Aboriginal peoples also need to have effective control over new resource development uh, and a just resolution of their land claims. We also say no to the dangerous pipelines, Enbridge, Kinder Morgan, uh, the uh, Line 9, Energy East, and other pipeline proposals to uh, further develop oil and gas for export. We're in favor of a moratorium on the exploration and development of shale gas through fracking. And we're also in favor of heavy fines and jail terms for corporate polluters and the, and the destructive environmental policies of the large corporations. Instead, we would create jobs through renewable energy, through research and development and the uh, implementation of uh, renewable energy while phasing out coal and nuclear energy um, and fossil fuel, reliance on fossil fuels. We'd also fund high-speed rail connections as a better alternative to highways. But all of these proposals are part of what we call a People's Energy Plan, the corner piece of which would be the nationalization of oil and gas in this country, putting it under the control of the people of this country, not the private corporations. That's the best way to ensure that we can transition to a sustainable environment and reduce uh, the impact of climate change and Canada's contribution to it. That's our fundamental approach to make a, a break with the drive of capitalism to continue to exploit our natural resources for private profit. Voting communist says put people and the environment first, not profits.